Uh, that's a great question, Evan. Let's move on to the next one. Juan uh, Shamoro. How have you adapted to DMR's bloom, and how drastically has Reach different from Halo 3? That's a tough question. It uh, is. The bloom is hard at first, man. It, it really is. Uh, you got to get used to it. It's not like any other Halo that we've played. You know, the BR was in Halo 2 and then Halo 3, and before that was the pistol where you had to leave your shots. So this is a completely different way of shooting. The whole map movement feels a little bit of like a shadow run type deal because I know the people at Bungie picked up a lot of people on uh, on shadow run staff. So it's it's a whole new feel and it's taken a while to get used to it, but I think we got it down now. And the thing I like about Reach is Halo Three, you have at the end of Halo Three, everyone can shoot. Yeah. You you go against anyone, you're like you're flipping a coin to see who's going to win that BR battle. You don't want that, especially when you're playing for big money, you know, hundred thousands on the line. And if you get a BR fight. It's really up for grabs, and I think this game really has a skill gap to where if if you're losing a sh or if you're down a shot, you really are in trouble. Like the bloom, you could spam somebody and come mm -hmm. back. I mean, there's you a lot also of cool time your shots. Yeah, you know I mean? and also a lot of a lot of shooting is about angles. So you know, more or less, if you have the advantage and you get hit, you know, from down low, that's when you kind of are forced to maybe spam up onto somebody. And yeah, they have the advantage, and they could possibly take their shot slow because they're above you. But if you're, you know, spamming and you hit those good shots, you deserve to win, which is really nice. You know, if you got the first two shots on somebody at the end of Halo 3, they're definitely winning that battle. And, no doubt. And it kind of was frustrating that, you know, every BR battle was so close when you may have had better positioning on somebody. So, um, I feel like there's a little less auto-aim in this game, and, you know, I like yeah. the bloom so far, so we'll see how it goes. And land is completely different than Xbox Live, so I recommend that everyone goes and plays land.